Yeah, this is my solar wa water collector. Hot water collector. Anyway, it's kind of expensive to build. I use one inch copper pipes. Uh, they go around in a series, and what ends up happening is the water comes in, goes up one side, and then goes back down, then up the other. And the connections might not look that way, but that's that's the way that I ended up putting so it goes, head yeah. stops in it. So the water just runs up and down, and then I covered the copper pipes with uh, this aluminum foil, and I ended up taking and making a kind of a jig where I could bend the aluminum foil. And, oh, that's uh, that roofing stuff. Or... Yeah, it isn't exactly aluminum foil. It's aluminum flashing. Flashing, yeah. Yeah, you know, a real light gauge and bent over and spray painted black, and then I just staple it onto the platform there. And, wow. And so then it I, really warms up oh, it, the water and... If you don't have any water running through there and, and you let it get it good and warm and then you open up the valve and if you got PVC plastic pipe, it'll melt the pipe. It wow. Cre it creates so steam. So it cooks it. Oh yeah, it gets right to the boiling point of steam. Wow, you know, it's that's like amazing. It, it's on the same principle uh, as a, um, a solar oven, you know, where people cook a roast or, or whatever, yeah. you know. And what we used it for was to warm up the water to that we had run that we had pipes running under lead plastic um, and on top of that we had you know our plants growing. Yeah and then you can have an early and late harvest because the ground's warmer and you have the plastic and cool. It's, yeah, extend your growing season. It'd be a great way to warm up water for your house too. Oh yeah. Awesome idea.